if you are a school administrator and you waste a lot of valuable time in producing your students report cards then i would advise you to watch this video to the end because i have the best solution for you so see how we can do it the easiest way so here is just the home page of our school record card system when you have this record card system all you have to do is to make some settings at the level of the settings you can set up with the information concerning the school in question here you can uh, put the different evaluations you can put uh, the different uh, grading system and here you have to put the location where you will want to save uh, your report cards say uh, uh, i have to create i've created a folder for example in my documents called report good here you can change the logo you can uh, decide to import another logo and put it here once you do that all uh, the worksheet is going to have access to the logo from here, you can uh, create the different uh, classes that you have. Um, like, for example, you have from, from one to opposite. And for each of those classes, you can uh, give a specific uh, class. Like, for example, for form one, you can create from one B, from one A, and so on. Once you've done that, you can equally uh, create now the students because that's the basic things. Uh, you have to create all the students who are in the school and you give them the specific classes in which they are. Then uh, you can create, you can give them a matricol number and uh, their other information. Once that is done, you can equally create the subjects of every class. Uh, like here, you have from one, from two. Uh, if you scroll that way, you're going to see the different uh, classes. You precise all the subjects that are being taught in each of those classes with the coefficients and uh, the teachers giving those courses. You bother not about this. It's all fine. So once you've done these uh, three settings, uh, creating students, creating subjects, all you will have to do for the rest of the year is just to enter the student's marks. So once you create a student, for example, in any of uh, a class, it will automatically come and appear in the list of students in each of those classes. This side represents mark sheets and this side represents report cards. So when you create a mark sheet for a class year, you get a report card here. So here, for example, all the students who are, for example, in from 1, say from 1B, from 1A, from 1C, or whatsoever is going to appear here. If you want to have students only in from 1A, you click on this and the list is going to filter only students who are in from 1a or if uh, you want all students you stop the filter and uh, all the students are going to appear in this list so all you will have to do is to check on the different subjects if for example it's the history uh, teacher who comes in here is where he has to put his marks for the students you know, say for from one um, first sequence or second sequence or third sequence and so on so for all the subjects are there all the subjects are there you just need to come for your particular subject in question and uh, you start imputing the marks of every student Coming back to this, once you've done this, everything is done. You just need to come and print out your report card because your report card is already there waiting for you. And this is a whole consolidated report card, which is going to show uh, the, the marks of students uh, for all the classes. Like if I want to print uh, for first sequence, I come here and I select first sequence. If I want to uh, show second sequence uh, exam, I click here and I select second sequence. If I do not want a uh, third and fourth sequence, I just need to remove it from here and it's going to be empty here. So all these are informations for the student. All the subjects are been being uh, we enter all the marks uh, for all uh, the second sequence they will have also been appearing here so once you have that if you want to print uh, for only second uh, only third and fourth sequence you come here only fifth and sixth sequence you come here um i am just going to present uh, for just first and second sequence down here you will have a quick uh, summary of the student in terms of uh, his position for first sequence second sequence based on the sequences you've chosen up there and here you have uh, the students the mark for first sequence and the second sequence and the, the terms average if you, i also selected for third and fourth sequence they will appear there if i also select for fifth and sixth sequence they will equally appear there with uh, the different uh, terms yeah is the highest marks lowest mark and the number of absences so once that is done all you have to do First of all, this is for the first student, the student with uh, the matricul, with this matricul, and this is the name here. If you want to see for the next student in this very same class uh, from one, you just need to go up here. You click up, you see this is matricul number two, this is the student's name, and can you see how the marks has automatically changed? Uh, you go to the next student, no, matricul number three, and these are his marks. Uh, the next student, he does not have any marker. So when you go down, uh, you go down, you're going to have uh, the students of the, the marks of all the students. If you want to print only for one student, you come and convert one by one. One by one, we convert only these students' report card, meaning the student with this matricul number one. If uh, you want to convert for all the students uh, in this class from one, you just convert all to PDF. So let's give it a test. If I click on convert all to PDF, they will ask, please, before you validate, uh, uh, make sure there is no open PDF in the machine. Please try and check if there is no open PDF in the machine. If there is any open PDF, you close it before you take OK. So when you take OK, do you want to print and save the report card in PDF format? So you take yes. From then, uh, it is going to convert uh, all the students' report cards gradually. You can see it is working it out. Uh, uh, then we will go and check. Uh, you just uh, take OK. 
Yeah, he said the second student is already printing. So if there are 100 students, once you've imputed all their marks, you just need to click convert all to PDF and all the students' report cards are going to be printed gradually for you. But if you want to print one by one, you just convert one. If you want to print only for one student, you just take it this way. So from there, they will say, congratulations, you have successfully converted uh, all the students' report cards into PDF. Go and check in the folder called report. Remember, I've created a folder called report. When I went to my settings, I mentioned uh, the location of... Um, of uh, the, the, the report cards as report. So if I go, for example, in my documents um, and I check in a folder called report, you will see all the students' report card has been converted. Just I need just to now uh, open, uh, connect the printer to my machine, and then I just uh, click on it and I print the student report card. So the students' uh, report cards are already ready for you to be printed. So that is how easy the system is. So uh, when you just uh, come back here, you have everything. You go to form two, you enter student marks. Uh, go to form three, you enter the student marks. And from this way, you will have all the report cards. In case of any help or assistance, you just click on help. You get the contacts and everything here. And everything is just fine. So that was just a demo. We can custom it to your school needs. Is it for a secondary school? Is it uh, for a university? We just need the information. And we custom it to your school needs and uh, you have it anywhere in any computer you can use it because it is built with the use of ms excel so if you need a demo you just uh, write to the contact uh, on the screen or you write to the mail and we're going to provide something for you something for your school which is going to help you to easily get your report cards at any time get to you there